Northern Outdoors TV here. Going to do a little review slash overview of my Markham Recon 5 Plus underwater camera. So, opening it up here, it's got this 5 inch widescreen LCD monitor. It's got a 16 by 9 aspect ratio and it's also 800 by 480 pixels, which is a high resolution color or black and white screen. So to power on the Recon 5 Plus, you just press and hold the power button there. And first things you're going to notice is there's a variety of on-screen features. Right here, it's got your battery indicator. And a full charge on this battery should last you around six hours of continuous usage. In this corner, it's got your direction. So it's going to tell you the cardinal directions of which way the camera, while in the water, is actually facing, whether it's north, northwest, etc. Down here, you've got your water temperature, where the actual camera is in the water column. And down here, it'll tell you exactly how far to the inch that camera is down in the water. So in order to utilize the DVR function of the Recon 5 Plus, if you press the record button once, it'll take a screenshot or a picture of the physical display. If you press and hold it down, it'll start to record video and store it to the micro SD card in which you can use up to a 32 gigabyte micro SD card. So here's some sample footage from my Recon 5 Plus of a little brook trout being caught there. So you can see here a little jig in the background. That camera is actually probably about 10 feet away on another hole. And it's also nice on this camera, it'll show you what kind of structure you're dealing with. And it'll also show you what kind of vegetation you're on top of as well. So, to navigate the menu, you click on this menu slash enter button, and you can go to library, right here, where it'll save your photos and videos which you've previously recorded during the day, or that are previously recorded onto the SD card. Then you can go down to the settings tab, where you can change your monitor settings, which will have your brightness, sharpness, contrast, and color displays. And then you can go back in there, go down to settings, and go down to your system settings which is where you can change your time and date and stuff like that to exit out you go all the way down and hit enter on the back and then all the way down to exit so the camera has a 110 degree field of view and to help with that viewing while you're underwater it's got infrared and LED lighting that you can use as well on the infrared you're obviously not going to be able to see the infrared but you can press the infrared button here where it says IR and it's got three levels of adjustability. On the LED light, you can press that button three times. Each time it's going to get a little brighter. And the fourth time, it'll turn off. So the camera comes with 50 feet of cable. And the on-screen functions of depth and direction make it a lot easier when you're trying to locate your lure, find bottom, or whatever you're using your camera for. So for right around $400, you can get a small pocket-sized camera with big features such as the DVR. So it's also got this quarter inch by 20 thread female adapter so you can hook it into any tripod or standard camera equipment. Subscribe, you know, for more content, more videos like this and that one up there. Make sure to find us on Facebook, Instagram, Snapchat. Check out these people and thanks for watching.